Okay, let us verify Rolle's theorem. So the question is verify mm, Rolle's theorem. for the function fx equal to e to the power minus x sin x okay so you don't have to do anything you just need to verify it now we know that exponential function is a differentiable function and mm, and sin x is also differentiable Let's write f1x equal to e to the power minus x is differentiable on oh verify rules theorem. Whenever we have rules theorem, this should mention where are you going to verify. So on the interval 0, 5 pi f1x equal to e to the power minus x is differentiable on is differentiable on 0 comma pi closed interval uh, we don't need closed interval open interval is enough it is differentiable in fact throughout r so it's differentiable in open interval as well as closed interval is continuous on close interval 0 comma pi here we could have written open interval as well no problem similarly f to x equal to sin x is continuous as well as differentiable as well as differentiable on 0 comma pi now you know product if uh, if a function is con if two functions are continuous then their product is also continuous and if two functions are differentiable then their product is also differentiable therefore fx is nothing but e to the power minus x into sin x is continuous as well as differentiable continuous and differentiable in 0 comma pi so first step you need to show that the function is continuous on the closed interval differentiable in the open interval that we have done it second step at the end point the function the value of the function must be equal okay f0 equal to that is 0 f pi equal to e to the power minus pi into sine pi that is also 0 okay therefore 
f0 equal to f pi so at the end point the fun the value of the function are equal therefore by rules theorem there exist a constant c such that that f test of C equal to 0 but what is F test X but F test X is D DX of e to the power minus X into sine X that's a product of two function so first into derivative of second e to the power minus x into d dx of sine x plus second into derivative of first u into derivative of v plus v into derivative of u so derivative of sine is cos derivative of e to the power minus x is e to the power minus x into derivative of minus x that is minus 1 so by rolls theorem you need to compute c so that f dash c equal to 0 or by rule theorem says there exists a constant c so that f dash c equal to 0 therefore there exists a constant c where in 0 comma pi such that f dash c f dash c is e to the power minus c cos of c minus sine of c equal to 0 now if you want such a thing to be 0 you just need to show that such a thing happens that means such a constant c in the interval 0 comma y 0 comma pi exist that will happen only if since exponential are never 0 cos of c equal to sine of c that uh, that is cos of c equal to sine of c that is if cos of c is not equal to 0 uh, sorry there exists a constant c in open interval I made a mistake here Rose theorem says there exists a constant in the open interval that means 0 and pi has to be excluded otherwise I could okay otherwise also I could not have done anything here mm okay there exists constant c in open interval 0 comma pi such that this has to be 0 but e to the power minus c can never be 0 so cos of c equal to sine of c that is 10 of constant equal to 1 obviously that there are many such constant and one of them is pi by 4 oh we can take Hmm. you can take 45 degree or 130 yeah only one that is 
that is in 0 comma pi so you have verified rows theorem you just need to take c equal to pi by 4 and that's there in the interval 0 comma pi open interval 0 comma pi 